Greetings, comrades! Our Gaming Cave is back with another episode of MKCP. Better was I touched uh, Chaotic, so we're going back to it. Apparently there's another version of Chaotic coming out, Chaotic 2. It's right, right now it's in beta, I think uh, No Continues and MKA, they, ha they have the current beta code for it. They're, they're testing it out for a bit. I'm curious how it's going to play out. Anyway, um... I just don't know what we're gonna do for this video. Mm. I forgot how huge this character select screen is. Um, you know what surprised me? Here. Okay, Fujin against Smoke. <coughs> okay, that Ranos kick surprised me weird. Oh yeah, I forgot this guy's little glitch. What? Okay, pretty cool projectile attack there. Jesus Christ. He can't... It's a weird run there. Yeah, that was to say about this, Fujin. Get Baraka. This is a Raiden. Ethereal Raiden. Oh, it's that one uh, arena from Mortal Kombat Deception. Does the jaw close? Oh, he has a blade sweep. Oh yeah, gotta have that. Oh, and it lasts a little longer compared to, like, it just hits once, and, but in the actual game, it just hits once, and then it knocks the character back, but here, it's mainly for looks, though. Yeah, it's rock out, not much else to say. I know in Mortal Kombat Trolls, you had this, like, blade spin attack. I forgot how you do it, though. Oh, well. So we got Tremor and Jade. One. Fight. Here we the Earth Bike, which doesn't do anything. Oh, he had to be cl a little closer. <laughs> Is this supposed to like be effective all across the screen? Okay, you got the throwing rocks. Nice if I have move lists, but again, uh, k -Doc doesn't have move lists, so you first have to guess. For the most part, it's just, you know, the basic, you know, down forward low punch, you know, backpack high punch, all that jazz. Alright. At least LK-52 is kind of pretty simple to do. But he's lacking in terms of special moves. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna do a few more practice rounds and I'll uh Round one. Fight. Then I'll uh guess uh I'll do a few CPU matches. Do they have like that weird on a weird kick or something. Oh, there we go. Alright. <laughs> a snake. And what the fuck? What the shit? Oh my god, what the frick is this? Get out of here, Mr. Bean. What's with this arena? Weird. Alright, 
Let's go and uh, watch and learn. Let's crank up the uh, AI because I want to see how this plays out. Okay. And let's do simultaneous. Let's see how that plays out. Random. This is going to be interesting. Maybe it will be chaotic, hence the name. So we got Reptile, Kentaro, Sector, and Flare. Let's see how this plays out. Hmm. Or if it's possible to speed the gameplay up, that'd be kind of bizarre. I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> sometimes boogies are more fun to watch than they are to play. Of course I'll still play them, but sometimes I just want to do some CPU matches and see how, how crazy it gets. This is the AI maxed out, by the way. There goes Flare. There goes Reptile. Oh. I had a feeling Katara would get on top. I was only using projectiles. The sector did is a teleport uppercut, though. But that's about it. Oh, <laughs> like they're kind of surrounded. <laughs> but like the old saying goes, a cornered rattlesnake is the most dangerous rattlesnake. Too much blocking. Oh, there goes Sector. Oh, reptiles on the ropes. There he goes. I had a feeling uh, that wasn't gonna last long. All right. So Havoc and Kano. Oh my god, I forgot how horrible that head sprite is. It's worse than the Sue Howl sprite. Like Black Blue Kang and Cybot. The other movies are more fun to watch, because here they like just have, like they just like block like 80% of the time. So it goes out saying that Havoc Sprite is shit. Thank God he's not Project. And if he is, I hope they do a better job with the Sprite. I still don't know whether he's used a Sue Howl Sprite from here on Project. Because that Sue Howl Sprite is shit. Same thing with Kira. Cobra, they did a decent job. Draman, so far, is the best I've seen. A custom Sprite for us non-2D character. Well, it did that same amount of effort for the others. You see, it's like block. It's like 8%. I feel like... I'm pretty sure if we killed Captain Alex was a Boogan, this is probably what it would look like. Striker. Against Reptile and another Cybot. Oh, he's about to do a super, but. Didn't pull off.
what just happened? Did y'all see that? That was weird. No grenade's gonna help you, Striker. <laughs> Oh, he's using a chainsaw, boy. <laughs> Didn't help you that time, did it, noob? Alright. <laughs> Next round. What the heck? Wait, it's a fireball and scratch. What's that super supposed to be? Whatever it is, it didn't do anything. Okay, come on, dude, stop blowing your load. You're in the middle of a fight. I still don't know why he's using a chainsaw. He ain't Leatherface. Well, there goes Zhu Kang. Wow, that actually turned the tide. Oh, he has a scythe. Oh my god, no, stop pulling your load. Okay, you know, shoot out of your head. That's, that's a little more acceptable. That kind of makes sense. I just don't know why it has to be below your waist. That doesn't make any sense. See? <laughs> I'm pretty sure King of Fire's Anthology and Mugen Infinite would be like, better uh, watching. You see that they're blocked most of the time. Well, Alright. <laughs> I'm probably going to keep this uh, video a little short. <laughs> so, uh, what I'm going to do is we're going to do uh, three more AI matches simultaneous because they're a little more fun. So we got Ultimate Sub Zero and Dark against Flare, C Cyborg Flare, and Round. In color, Grimace League name for him. Oh, it's a uh, blade, cyborg blaze, not flare. Can I didn't notice that? So, well, he didn't last long. Bad time to do a pseudo breakdance, Sub Zero. <laughs> they actually did pretty well. I thought they were gonna get owned, but I guess not. It does make interesting watching, but uh, it's not as action packed as I was hoping it'd be. Again, they block most of the time. A lot of the characters don't have supers, so you think that we like turn the tide. I have no idea what color just did. Oh, <laughs> didn't realize the color had a striker style gun. I'm surprised they did pretty well. Alright. Going to do two more AI matches. So we got some sort of ninja, some sort of Liu Kang against some sort of Cyber Ninja and Kano. Virus Smoke, Nightwear, and Black Liu Kang again. Oh, Breaker, okay. Oh 
Why not make an interesting match unless you enjoy watching characters walk all the time or do it with the throws? Volcano's down. <laughs> Wu Kang's surrounded. He needs to do something. Not get his ass kicked, but oh well. Yeah, Reptile's like, what the heck just happened? <laughs> I don't know what to do with Nightmare. I know Nightmare, but not Nightmare. Like, what's the deal with this guy? And I know, uh... Mr. G-Star, he mentioned this before. A lot of the... The palette swaps... Of some of these ninja characters and stuff are shit. I thought they just look different, but... Do the exact same moves as the... Characters that are supposed to be based on. There goes virus smoke. And Black Blue King's down. And that's a little choke there. But alas... It was not enough. Alright. One more AI match and... I'll call this video. Yes, I'm working shitty Mortal Kombat 1 Katana. Against, uh... I guess Blaze and, uh, Monk? Hulk Monk? Yeah. Super Sector, okay. Oh, what the heck? Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, Super Sector is pretty cool, actually. That's, that's his block, so it's pretty cool. Whoa, what the heck? Why does the music keep glitching? And that monk guy's kicking ass despite being low on health. And there he goes. I still don't know... What the heck's Blaze doing? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Don't know what that was about. Well, Alright. Those are some huge ass candles, by the way. <laughs> Dude, why does it just keep glitching? I guess that's Blaze that's doing it. Jesus Christ, they're getting, getting ganged up on. That does make for some it's a pretty screwed up situation. Like you have one opponent in front of you, one opponent behind you, and they're just, you know, owning you. That does make for some pretty hilarious watching. Super Septor. What the frick is Blaze doing? Oh my god. Those more come at one female and just spreads her shit. Yeah. I think it's safe to say Blaze is exactly a perfect character here. Yeah, don't expect too many AI battles in the World Comic Book because again, they block most of the time. Pretty sure King of Fighters Anthology and Mugen Infinite, they'll make for some better watching. Blaze is almost dead. There we go, Super. There we go. Well, that was uh, unexpected. I was hoping Blaze and Sector would take the match, but I guess not. Well, I think that was it for this video, comrades. Um, 
Yeah, some of that I'll definitely go back to Mugen Infinite. Again, it takes a long time to load, so don't expect too many videos for Infinite. Though I still enjoy that Mugen. It is pretty fun. Anyway, I forgot what... I forgot how many these Mortal Kombat videos I did. I lost count. I know it's a little, at least 10. I know that much. I think it's the 12th one. I'm not sure. But I'll find out later. Anyway, this is Evan Caleb signing out.